Hello everyone. This is Katie Colleen here. Welcome back Colleen Clan. Or if you are new, then come join the family for another small business unboxing. This is the part of the show where I buy stuff from a small business, treat myself, and then I show you guys what I got. Uh, in previous videos, I've had about 12 tiny packages, and in this video, I just have two very big packages. And that is because the theme of this small business unboxing is mobility aid decorations, customizable mobility aids, aesthetic mobility aids. <laughs> I make cute outfits for myself and for my mobility aids. Uh, so I have quite a few tutorials out there on how I make crutch covers or wheelchair covers or how I make fairy wings that attach to wheelchairs. And uh, every now and then I get comments that say stuff like, oh my gosh, this is so creative. Why has no one thought of this? Uh, I wish I could have these, but I'm not very crafty. I wish companies made these. This video is for you. First of all, I'm pretty sure mobility aid decorations have been around for as long as mobility aids have been around. I just make the YouTube tutorials on them. Um, and furthermore, there are companies out there that make, you know, pretty mobility aid stuff. Uh, so this video is going to be showcasing two of those companies. So to start, This is from Cool Crutches. So these are customizable, pretty aesthetic crutches and walking sticks. I've also heard that they're like really comfortable and good quality. So this isn't a crutch cover. It is a whole set of forearm crutches in here. Like this is a whole mobility aid. Um, one that I will need a box type to open, excuse me. So I got a set of pink forearm crutches. It's actually kind of funny because they also had glittery pink. And I asked my husband like, hey, should I get pink or glittery pink? And he was like, no more glitter. No more. We've had enough glitter in this house. And honestly, at this point, I kind of agree with him. I'm just finishing up a crazy sequined cosplay build. There's sequins like, all over my floor. I need a vacuum in here. These are like a very bright pink. That's okay. I love many pinks, okay? I know the outfit today is like very baby pink, but like this is also a pretty pink. There we go. Oh, I love this. Okay, wait, I have to show you this feature. <laughs> so I have my current crutches back here. Okay, so we'll do a little comparison. These are the $30 Medline crutches on Amazon. They're like, you just need crutches, don't want to spend a lot of money, you just need something that works. Uh, they're kind of ugly. <laughs> so that's what I've been using for the last few years, just because like it's worked. Uh, but the thing with these crutches is uh, there's like this opening here and my arm would always slip through it. So I have a headband holding it on. And this is just one of my fabric crutch covers that I made. Um, but I've just always used these. They're cheap, they're durable, they get the job done. But what I was gonna say I really like about the cool crutches is they already have like, see my arm can't slide out. Whereas I had to get like a headband and wrap it around my old crutches. This is just built so your arm can't slide out. Oh my gosh. Discovering the world of nice forearm crutches and I it is full of surprises. Um, so these actually have like a left and a right hand crutch. Um, the handles are different. With my old crutches, it's just like a circle handle, like left, right, doesn't matter. But with these, they're actually formed to like fit left or right hand so it's more comfortable to grip they come with these little covers to put over your handles nice nice okay now to set the height okay maybe i should read the instructions maybe i don't know as much as i thought i know come on guys let's adjust our crutches 
on the Medline crutches, uh, you just have this little button here. And you just push it in and then adjust it to the different holes. The cool crutches have the same thing, but more aesthetic. <laughs> so they have a little clip that you pop out. Oop. Oh, that went like really far away. Excuse me. So it has a clip that basically is the same thing as these, um, but it's all like much more hidden and looks prettier. I just made it the same height as my Medline crutches because I've, I've used those for years and years at that height. So here we go. Yes, and then you just stick the clip back in to hold it in place. They also have a second clip up here to adjust how high you want this cuff. So on the Medline crutches, uh, you can adjust the height here of like the cuff. Um, so I guess I'll just, I think it's probably already about the same. Yeah, it's already at like the same height. So I'll just leave it where it is. These are not the same height. That was my first error. It is my professional opinion that your forearm crutches should be the same height. So let's try it again. Oh, these are so comfy. Oh my gosh. See how the handles are shaped differently? See how there's like a space here to rest your palm? So it's more even pressure on your hand. Man, these feel so good. Ooh, also you can see my sushi socks. <laughs> uh, they do a whole bunch of different colors and styles and you can also customize something that's completely unique too if you wanted like your dog's face on your crutches or something. <laughs> I've definitely thought about getting some crutches for them with like the Supergirl symbol on them or something more specific for cosplay because these are like an entire mobility aid. Not really cost effective for me to get a whole pair of crutches just for a costume. So I just wanted to match my general aesthetic, which is pink. I know you don't see crutches very often on my social media anymore, um, but I do use them for my job. I actually work a desk job and the wheelchair is kind of overkill just for walking from my car to my desk and then I just sit at my desk for work all day. So I use crutches for my job. You don't really see them very much in my videos and yes, part of that is because my disability has gotten a bit worse, but the other half of the equation is just that my video quality has gotten so much better that it takes a lot more work to make videos for you guys. So in old videos, I could just twirl around for like two minutes and that was my cosplay showcase. And now it takes like an hour to film a showcase for my cosplays. You know, we get set up, we do lighting. I have my husband who does videography and photography. So we actually do like a photo shoot session. We check out different locations, like <laughs> basically making the cosplay showcases for my YouTube videos is just so much more than it used to be that it's not super comfortable for me to do those on crutches. But I will still give you guys a little showcase with these because I just think they're so pretty and they feel so, so good on my hands. One final thing about the crutches, as you may know, all of my mobility aids have names and because these are like entire mobility aids, not just decorations, we need to name these. So this is Pink Tilda and this is Mr. Pink. Please welcome them to the Colleen clan. This is from Izzy Wheels. They make wheelchair spoke covers. The box has been through some sort of ordeal in shipping, but hopefully everything's still accounted for. Ah, uh, that's sweet. They wrapped it. If you've watched any of my other small business unboxings, one of my favorite things is just how small businesses will go the extra mile for you. They'll give you freebies, stickers, you know, wrap it for you. 
Um, and that's why I love doing these videos and supporting these small businesses. Ooh! So, like with the cool crutches, I'm not sure it's really cost effective to get covers to go with a specific cosplay. So I just got some that I felt matched my general aesthetic uh, so I could wear it with like fashion looks. These are the ones I picked out. So with my spoke covers, I make little fabric straps that tie around the connection from the wheel to the push rim. As you can imagine, this varies from chair to chair. So my method of making spoke covers is it's you very much have to make it yourself like you have to craft it yourself with your wheelchair there it's very specific to your wheelchair uh, so when i saw izzy wheels doing this and how they had kind of made a universal spoke cover that could work for pretty much any wheelchair i was really interested to know how and that's because they use velcro which goes around the spokes i actually think i need to bring my wheelchair in here to show you here is my wheelchair his name is Walter. He's a very good wheelchair. Uh, so the way that these connect, I think I need to pop off the wheel. Excuse me, Walter. So it does fit. It kind of sits inside the push rim. And then on the inside, I just had to put this Velcro around the spokes. So just take this Velcro. And it's just sitting like behind the push rim, so it's already kind of held in there a little bit too. Wheelchairs just like pick up hair. Like every wheelchair does it, it just picks up hair in the wheels, so. Mm. I would say these are a lot more like the foam wheel covers I've made than the fabric ones. I made a pair of Captain America wheels out of EVA foam. I think these are much more like that and how they fit into the chair. And fun little side note, Izzy Wheels actually makes Captain America wheel covers. So if you watch that video and we're like, man, I wish I could have Captain America wheels, you can like literally buy Captain America wheels from Izzy Wheels. So I think that's really cool. Um, okay. Man, there's so much hair in my wheel. Ew. If your wheels don't pop off, I could see this being a little bit harder, but you will have to take them off to pump up your wheelchair. So there's that. They're pretty. They have so many different designs on there. This was just my favorite, but yeah, they're really pretty. They feel like they're gonna be durable and sturdy. Uh, this is something I'd feel comfortable leaving on my chair just for every day. Uh, whereas with my fabric wheel covers, I really only put them on for cosplay and then take them off because I don't want them to get like beat up. But I feel like these are much more durable, <laughs> can take some damage. small businesses to check out. I will link them both in the description if you've been wanting aesthetic mobility aids. And if you're a bit more crafty and don't have quite as much funds, I will also link my playlist for how to make mobility aid decorations uh, out of fabric for yourself. So check those out for aesthetic mobility aids. I wish only the most aesthetic mobility aids for all of you. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye!